about 10 years ago as far as how you would be more efficient now? Or does that make sense? Um, well, you know what? Back then, technology wasn't as good as it was now. You know what I'm saying? So I, I don't think it does anything different. I, I want to do it because my, my career lasts so long because I've been smart and, it, and I did it in stages. The first few years, you know, of training, I didn't do, like I told you, I didn't do cardio, I didn't have a trainer, I did all that stuff by myself. Okay. The second phase is I hired Joe McNeil, you know, back then, when I made him work together. He came out of retirement and he, he, he you know, he worked with Flex, you know, Paul Gillette and, you know, uh, you name him back then. So he was a, he was a man back then. So he came out of retirement to train me. Me and him were together for about six or seven years, you know what I'm saying? And then my final stage, which is now, three years ago, which is now, is I incorporated Charles Glass into my regiment, you know? So, you know, you come to a point where you, you start getting to a point where, you know, it's hard to get in the gym. It's hard to be motivated. You know what I'm saying? So, especially in my gym, there's no truth. There's no pros out there. I'm the biggest guy in the gym. You know, you go in the gym. There's only three people in the gym. That's the motivation. You know what I'm saying? So, I went out to LA. I started training with Charles Last. When you walk in Gold's Venice, I know some of you guys have been in there. You know the atmosphere is unbelievable. You know, you got some of the greatest champions, Arnold. You name it. That trained in that gym, and they all on the wall and everything. So you get motivated. So you walk in the gym. So I started going out there and training and stuff, and um, you know, but I was going there and stayed there for two weeks, rent a car, come back home for two weeks. I was in Florida, and I was going from Florida to LA. Two weeks there, two weeks there, two weeks there. Two weeks there. And then so it came a point where I said, you know what? Why am I spending all this money? My girlfriend was like, you need to just go ahead, get an apartment out there. You ain't got to lug all this stuff back every time you come back. Just get an apartment out there. See if one of your vehicles out there and just leave everything there. You got to leave all your clothes there. You got to drag all that stuff back. And then you got to pay another two thousand dollars a month on rental cars. You know what I'm saying? So living in hotels, I'm spending I'm spending three thousand dollars a month on hotels. So I'm saving five grand, but I can just get an apartment out there for you know two thousand and ship my car out there for free. So that's what I did. I've been out there for three years, man. It's a blessing because I was about ready to retire. If you remember three years ago, I, I wasn't, I wasn't, the, I wasn't the blade. I was the, I was the butter knife, man. I was getting ready to retire. <laughs> so, but resurrect my career, man. Going out there training with Charles, man. I got that fire back. And it's still there. Because when you walk out there and you train in, the, in front of a legend like Charles Glass, you want to train. You don't want to let it down. You know what I'm saying? So I give it all I got. Every time I work out, man, and my body changes right now. I got with George, and we started eating clean. Because I, you know, off season, I would eat what I want. I eat cake, cookies, all that stuff, but still stay in shape. When I was younger. So, but when I got with George, you know, even though I wasn't eating it all the time, but I still was eating a lot of junk. So George was like, listen, we're going to start doing some different stuff. We're going to put you on clean food year round. And eat that for clean rice and, and you know, and that, and that amount of food changed my body all the way around again, man. We did an awesome detox, you know, you got detox, you do all that stuff, man. Detox is a great food. Okay, you get your nice, healthy detox, you know, with some, you know, with healthy stuff, you know what I'm saying? And get your, get yourself detox every now and again, you know, every three months or four months, you know what I'm saying? Don't be afraid to do that, it's good for you. Um, I was even going to the colon place, getting, getting my coffee, you know, getting collagen and stuff. All that stuff is good stuff, man. 